I'm Tony Fleming from Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Thank you so much for joining me on really a collectible car. Anytime you have cars that are uh, in low production numbers like this, they typically what I call future collectibles. This is one of 101 built, that's it. Just 101 of these, right? This is less than Hemi Cuda convertible or Hemi Cuda production figures, amazingly low. Not to mention the coolest styling of cars out there. You know, this uh, has gone through over the years from the 60s all the way up until now, a couple of different owners, and this is the next version of that owner that gave us a modernized version of it. And so not only do you get the great design, but you get some great driving techniques, you get some great uh, modern features, uh, like rack and pinion steering and disc brakes and all the comfort creatures, including an awesome, awesome interior. Lastly, these are a lot of these parts here are modern parts you can get right now. So they're super easy to service if you need service at any time. And that's why we love them so much. So anyway, it's one of the first, uh, we haven't had a lot of the convertible versions here. We've had a bunch of Avantis, but not a lot of convertibles. And this one's fun. Let's take a look at it and see what we got. All right, so this car is wrapped up in crimson red metallic, right? It is a beautiful color. Throw in the fact that because of some of the humps and lumps and things like that, it highlights it. Anytime you have metallic paint right like that, a lot of times people say, Tone, that's a great looking car, but they don't really know why. So let's talk about why. So we talk about uh, this right here, which was uh, just a great styling treatment from uh, the 60s. And then also when we go to here, we're talking about these are Corvette uh, knockoffs, right? With uh, Vogue radials on it, right? This is an expensive setup. This is $4,500 worth of wheels and tires, almost $5,000. If you don't like these, no worries. We could put a stock set on. We could put wires on. There's a host of options that you have with this car, which is really cool. I'm happy to, to buy these from you and get you something else as well. That's what's great. Anyway, I stay down here because the front of the car is so good looking. The paint is beautiful still. I love the color. White pinstripe is there. And the driving down the road, you're definitely, definitely, the likelihood of ever seeing another one like it is pretty slim. All right, so I like to talk about paint quality. So factory Studebaker paint, right? Come on up here and let's check this out. We have a low mileage car, it's been garage kept. This is beautiful and nice and crisp and clear in there. You can see the letters, check it out, right? That's exactly what you want, why it looks so good. Under these harsh LED lights, you can see all the details of our ceiling, even in the paint. That is nice looking paint. All right, so maybe you have no interest in going to a car show. Maybe you do want to go to a car show. If you go to a car show, people are going to want to look under the hood of this. And this is beautifully detailed. That's what makes for a great original car, too. Maybe you don't care about car shows. You just want to go in the garage and look at your cool Avanti engine compartment once in a while. Let's take a look around and see what we have, okay? All right, so fuel-injected 5-liter V8 in here, right? Power steering, modern air conditioning, power disc brakes, okay? Super beautifully detailed inside here. The original decals are still in place. That's what you get when you get a low mileage classic car, right? Easy to work on, standard parts, right? It's just a simple, simple car. It's not a super exotic uh, contraption going on here that's really ridiculous to, to maintain. It's nice modern day pieces that will allow you to have a nice time enjoying the car and just enjoy it for a really, really long time. Plus it's great to look at. The Avanti script on the air cleaner there looks great. And then you just close the hood like this here and boom. All right, so the styling back here is not like any other car you see out there, right? It's a modernized version of this car. Great sounding dual exhaust. This has some electronics in it, like a new head unit modern version of it because it has backup camera, a Bluetooth, things like that. If you don't like that, and you want it to be stock looking, that can be easily removed, but I think it's a nice feature and nice enhancement to it. I don't think it hurts the car at all. Uh, and then you got the great taillights of an Avanti, especially with the Avanti script. Awesome, awesome look. This sounds good, looks good, and so different than anything else that's out there. All right, before we head into the inside the car, let's talk about what a luxury car should look like inside the trunk, and this is exactly what we're talking about. Look how nicely finished this is. Not only does it have color match carpet to the interior, but it's got binding on it as well. You may say, Tom, why are you so excited about binding on a car? Well, that's the detail stuff that other people don't do. It's a lot cheaper just to put a mat in there, a regular carpet. Um, it comes with a color matched, color matched boot uh, case. So for the convertible top boot, it would go inside here. Spare tire, spare tire cover, jack, jacking instructions, all that stuff's in place. Uh, looks super nice in there. And I think that uh, 
you could go away for a weekend in this car and it's a functional car and that's what I like too as well. And we'll look inside, you kind of see that we've got back seat and all kinds of stuff uh, to use on a regular basis. All right, so you're walking up to your cool Levante convertible, right? You're walking up to it, you go, wow, this is what everybody else gets to see. However, what they don't get to see is you and what you get to see inside. And that's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna go get inside, check this thing out and see what you think. All right, so this is a nice size car, right? I'm 6'1", just to give you an idea of size, because that's a question I get asked all the time. I got tilt wheel. I got a nice size steering wheel. It's not too big. It allows people who are a little bit bigger uh, to get in these cars and enjoy them. They have a full set of gauges, man. I got gauges overload. Um, beautiful wood interior and matching power leather seats and beautiful carpet treatment and like little things that I see, like for instance, it says upgraded audio system, which has Bluetooth and the backup camera and things like that, but it also has power top, it has power windows, it has power locks, it has cruise control, it has tilt wheel, um, climate control, and even little things like the clock works. You say, well, Tone, isn't the clock supposed to work? It's a low mileage car. Yeah, but it's still, you know, it's still 2022 that we're, we're doing this video. You can just tell this car was a garage queen taken care of and loved for a really long time. Uh, and the interior is just as cool looking as the outside. The gauge selection is amazing. Seats are super comfortable. Back seat for like uh, the kids or another couple. Imagine going to dinner in the Avanti. Where do you want to go? Do you, what do you want to drive to dinner tonight? Do you want to drive the Blazer or do you want to drive the Avanti? Mm, yes, I say we drive the Avanti, darling. Yes, we shall. All right. Anyway, awesome. All right, so we close up this video on what I say is what I would call probably uh, a modern classic. So when I say modern classic, what's that mean? Well, it means that it has classic styling. It looks like an Avanti, right? It just looks like it. And then you get fuel injection, you get air conditioning, you get power disc brakes, you get uh, power windows and locks and backup camera and Bluetooth, tilt wheel and cruise control and gauges that are beautifully red lit. I mean, you get all of this modern great stuff wrapped up in a super classic body. It is an awesome car, that's why I love it so much. Power convertible top that's color matched too. This was a very expensive car for its time. I feel like these cars are gonna to continue to go up in value. Obviously I can't see the future, but these cars are selling for more than they were back then. Uh, and you can drive it and enjoy it too, which is super, super fun part of the hobby itself. Anyway, call us 301. 816-1000 will tell you all about this uh, Avante 2 convertible. And uh, if you don't mind, hit the like button down below there. That helps get our message out. Subscribe to the channel. We're putting new content out all the time. T is delivering some stuff right now. All right. And uh, uh, share this with your friends. I think they'll have some fun with us as well, at least hopefully. So what's it like to drive a modern exotic like an Avanti? It is amazing. I mean, it really is. It's so smooth. We were just talking about how effortless the power is, how rattle-free it is, how it handles so nicely, and it's so comfortable. This is such an amazing car. It probably has a lot to do with the fact that it only has 15,091 miles on it. Uh, and this is 2022 that we're doing this video. And it's just a beautiful car. And when you drive it, everybody looks at it you know why because nobody knows what it is like when's the last time you saw an avanti or an avanti convertible on the road and the answer is probably either never right or uh maybe just once back in uh back in the day as we might say but anyway it is a beautiful driving great handling car listen to it listen to it move around we're hitting the bumps and things no rattles and it's super simple to drive if you want you can get spirited and and drive it hard but I'm just driving your car kind of easy, making sure you can see what it looks like. So when you get it, it's gonna be awesome. All right, I'll see you on the next drive.